subscribe. It's red at YouTube.com. Some of the farmers say the fact that they have not been paid their money has landed them in dire financial straits. A very elderly and a distraught woman made an impassioned plea for what she says is due to her. I need my money from my grand picnic and I got dead. And me I got dead for hungry. So no give me my money, make me get for pay a taxes. Then I go arrest me, but I don't have no money for pay my taxes. You don't know, hear what is that? Several angry cocoa farmers picketed the cocoa industry board's Morgan Pass office in Clarendon this morning. The farmers were protesting what they say is months of unpaid money for cocoa supply to the board from as far back as 2010. The cocoa farmers weren't a large in number, but that didn't stop them from pressing home their point. The group, which was made up of mainly elderly persons, displayed their placards and shouted angrily to demand their money. They are going to arrest me, but I don't have no money to pay my taxes. You don't hear what I say? The cocoa growers say for months they have been awaiting payment from the cocoa board for the beans supplied from as far back as 2010. Increased payments due from November of last year are also to be paid along with payments from March and April. Give me my money! You don't hear what I say? The farmers say they have been to the cocoa board's office several times to query why no payments have been made. But they say no one has offered a satisfactory response. We want the cocoa board to be more decisive. Uh, Ricketts. And I'm um, taking into consideration the farmers that we had responsibility to be taken care of. And what means sources are um, farming because we are not employed by anyone else. We are self-employed. We depend on our cocoa. Give me my money! Cocoa to help to bring out um, our weekly or monthly um, responsibilities. So I ask him to be more decisive and take us into consideration because we still want to be a part of their company. When my grand picnic, them are about dead. I don't like to be told that the balance of payment is bonus. Give me my money! I prefer them call it second payment because from day one of delivery, a certain amount was reserved for each farmer per box. You don't hear what I say? Give me my money! That is due to repay. The cocoa crop year begins October each year and ends the following September. But the acting fermentary manager at the Morgan's Valley Cocoa Board office promised their wait would be coming to an end today. At the Morgan's Valley fermentary here, the checks are prepared and are dispatched here. You don't hear what is that? But unless the money is put in the system at the NCB Chapterton branch, the payments cannot be made. And those checks are already prepared and are waiting for dispatch. She says these monies will cover payments for the 2010 and 2011 crops and those payments missed from the start of the year. Karen Madden James, TVJ News. I need my money from my grand picnic and I got dead. And me I got dead for hungry. So no give me my money, make me get for pay taxes. Then I go arrest me, but I don't have no money for pay my taxes. You don't hear what I say? Give me my money! When my grand picnic, I'm about dead. Subscribe to this channel. Give me my money! It's threads at YouTube, otherwise known as Infamous Threads.